want me to get ratchet Niggas want me to attack it Put the hood on all the time, me cash it Crunch it like Bob Saget Pretty, I can't pass it Eating everything, nigga, no fasting I don't care how much you knew me in the past tense I ain't no Julia style, this ain't no last dance We pass it, wait Fucking on my ex, cause he validate me Fucking up a check, I don't want no receipt Mine get possessed, let my space speak freely Hey, my past can't escape me My pussy precedes me Why my heart the time change? I'm still playing the victim And you still playing the picky It's so embarrassing All of the things I need Living inside of me I can't see it It's so embarrassing All of the love I see Living inside of me I can't see I'm blind Never say that. I don't want pipe down, rather get paid back. Mama told me never shit where you lay at. I don't want righteousness. Hey, besties, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's Jada Simone, and you're watching Jada's channel. I don't love just anyone. I am not just anyone. I rock heels, I rock Jordans. And I wear wigs and rock my natural. Can you believe it says I'm pretty for a dark skin? So what's up bestie boos? It is Wednesday. Welcome to another vlog. Welcome to another week. Thank God for another day. I am working from home. Y'all know I'm happy whenever I'm working from home. This is my first work from home day of the week. Y'all know I only get two days to work from home of the week so I'm really trying to cherish shit. A lot has been going on. I've been in meetings back to back to back to back to back. It's currently... 11:34. I just got out of a meeting. I did make my acai bowl for breakfast, so I've been struggling to eat that since I woke up and got myself ready to like to hop on Zoom and stuff. But it's really good, so I'm gonna finish it. But like I said, it's 11:34, so it's about to be lunchtime. So there's that. I did wash my hair last night, so that's what you guys saw in the earlier clips. Y'all probably can't tell from this angle, but like this hair is bomb. It literally blends so well with my hair. People think that this is my hair. But I'm so obsessed with my Nina Page hair. Let me give y'all my coupon code so y'all can get some money off because the besties love to save some money. So my discount code is Jada Simone. I'll leave it on the screen and make sure you shop Nina Page hair. I will leave the link in the description box. The hair I have in is the Water Wave and it's part of the Rose Gold collection. The hair is so soft. Like I said, it blends so nice in my hair. And this sew-in is almost two months old. I got this sew-in done on November 22nd, I believe, or November 20th, one of those two days. And it is currently January 18th. So almost exactly two months old. And it still is very flat. So shout out to my stylist, Shalice. Lace by Lou because she really, I, she ain't laced me, but she piped this so in. So shout out to her and shout out to Nina Page for the amazing, amazing hair. So make sure you guys go shop and go get you some bomb hair that will last. Like I said, this sewing has been in my head for two months, but I've had this hair since June. So this hair is very, very durable. It is raw Indian hair from the temples of India. Like it's not virgin hair. It's not... Uh, what is it what's the other hair yaki um i don't know it's not that other hair like it's straight from an indian woman's head like and that was in my head and now you know it's, it's giving pocahontas <laughs> but yeah you guys that's what i'm doing today i do have a couple unboxings that i want to do so i guess i'll do those after i finish working a little bit i will catch y'all when there's really something to vlog about. All right, besties. So it is currently 5.14. I am done with work for the day. And I gave myself a little gel manicure. Y'all know I'm a gel manicure girly. And I have some unboxings. I got some goodies and I really want to show y'all. So first things first, Sephora. I got the new butter drop, uh, the new Fenty butter drop, the Valentine's Day one that she dropped. I did get the holiday one, the one that smells like cinnamon rolls, and I'm obsessed. I'm so mad I did not get multiples of that. Like, I'm so 
mad but it's fine she gonna come out with more it's fine i'm debating on if i want another one of this but i was like you know what let me try yeah i've heard mixed reviews so i got this i did an unboxing for this on my tiktok so if you're not following me on tiktok go ahead and follow me on tiktok but y'all it's super cute the packaging and is everything i put the paper back on for y'all you know had to put up a show for y'all but from sephora and since i am a vib member i did get early 24 hour access on sephora's app before this even launched so i hurried up and snagged it if you guys are following me on instagram i usually update when there are like sales or like early access things so make sure you're following me on instagram is it worth it y'all really want to know if it is worth it I didn't know if it was worth it, but now I'm glad I got it. And I ordered, let me see, let's see when I ordered. So I placed my order January 10th. It came yesterday, which was January 17th. So it took seven days to get here. No, I did not pay for express shipping because I was not that beat. $10 for express shipping when this is already like, what, $44? I don't even know how much it is because it is currently still sold out on Sephora's website. Wait, let's go see. Let's fact check to see if it's still sold out. Let's go to the Sephora app. Correction. This this is $45 and it's still currently sold out on the Sephora app and Sephora.com but you can still get it on the Fenty Beauty website. I think you can still get, get it. It's been a week. I don't think it's sold out yet but this I like I, I definitely tried it on. The formula is definitely like the holiday one. I don't have the original one but I did try it out on Sephora over the weekend. I'm not gonna get the original one because it just smells like Cetaphil. Like, you know, the face wash you to feel like it just smells like that. It don't smell like nothing. And I use Nivea and at least Nivea got a scent. So there's that. But when you first smell it, it's definitely a nice, cozy vanilla. And it gives me like vanilla ice cream vanilla. So I do like that. A lot of people were saying it was like a very faint vanilla. It's not f as faint as I thought it was. But it's a very nice light vanilla and I like that and it's nice and whipped. I love the consistency. It's still thick but like it's nice and whipped and creamy and I like it. The shimmer, y'all know I love me a good shimmer and you definitely do get the shimmer. I'm a chocolate girl and these rose gold shimmer flakes really just pop on my skin oh my goodness guys i really like this mm -hmm. i can't wait to really incorporate this into my self-care routine i know it's going to pair amazing with my kiali vanilla 28 y'all that van the vanillas together they gonna vanilla they gonna really vanilla and i can't wait so i'm definitely glad i got this i might be picking up a second one so yes it definitely is worth the hype these like uh higher end expensive body creams definitely will last you if you're like me because i have sensitive skin i can't be wearing this all day every day i can't wear fragrance on my body all day every day i break out so i do either mix them with my nivea um lotion or just wear my nivea lotion most of the time i only wear these for special occasions or if i'm doing like a self-care night yeah so definitely if you guys are still interested in getting this i will link it below in the description box to the fenty beauty website i got some more goodies yes i've been spoiling myself but these goodies were actually on sale and these goodies are actually for the house but they it's my house so they still for me anyway i got some hand soaps from bath and body works again follow me on instagram if you want to keep up with any sales or anything like that i always post those on my story but the first thing i want to pull out is this cactus blossom hand soap i love this this is my favorite scent from bath and body works so the next one i have is this chris morning air i want to do blue and lavender in my bathroom for march and april so i was like let me grab a blue hand soap so i grabbed this one and like i said i want to do blue and lavender so i also decided to grab a lavender one so i just got lavender vetiver so i wanted to read up on my kitchen line because as you guys know like lime lemony scents are good for the kitchen but i think they discontinued kitchen lime so i got the kitchen lemon and this will be going in its place in the kitchen and the last hand soap i got is this pink peach blossom all right y'all that is all of the goodies i got myself y'all know i like to you know spoil myself here and there <laughs> even though them other things they were on sale but we love a good sale anyway i'm about to go put up these hand soaps and i'll be right back hey y'all so i just wanted to show y'all where i store these hand soaps like i said every time they have this sale i do bring up on at least five of them so i gotta stash them somewhere but i got this four 
cube organizer from Target. I think it was only like $17. $17, maybe $25 the most online because y'all know in store Target, they be taxing, but online Target is usually cheaper. So, and this one right here is where I keep my hand soap. So as you guys can see, I already have what six already in here and then I have some extra washcloths because you always need extra washcloths. So I'm going to put the new ones that are here into here and we are going to be good to go. hey besties happy friday y'all i finally made it through this week when i tell y'all this has probably been the longest week of my life it feel like it's really like my first week being back in office all three days in office and when i tell y'all i'm going through it i'm just so over this like i i'm, I'm just over it i'm over it but it's friday and i am driving down to maryland to go see my boyfriend so i'm currently packing i'm working right now but i'm on my lunch break but i'm currently packing i packed all like my undergarments pajamas socks skincare body care all that stuff in the bag i'm just trying to decide like what outfit i want to bring because i'm only staying for the weekend like i'm going down tonight and we just chilling in the house to sit tomorrow yeah saturday <laughs> we are going out and then sunday i will be driving back up here so i only need one outfit for real but y'all know i'm extra so i'm debating on if i want to do like a jeans outfit and like get cute for our date night or if i want to do a little chill look and i'm really feeling a chill look so i have this pink sweatsuit that i got from my parents for christmas and it's cute like it has the leopard print if you know me you know i love me some leopard print so this will be cute i could pair it with my leopard print mcqueens or just be super duper cozy and just pair with, pair with uggs or some yeezys so this is the outfit that i'm thinking about but then i'm like mm, do you want to get cute and i really don't want to get cute i really don't like if you know me you know i'm a cozy girl so i don't know i think i'm gonna decide on like what outfit like what jean type outfit i can pack but this is definitely going in the bag and then i have all my pajamas and my lounge clothes and then everything else is packed i also I also packed my Marc Jacobs bag so I just have um some shades because I'm, I'm a shades girl all year round so like some regular shades for when I'm driving and stuff my macbook my chargers my camera charger perfume all that good stuff is in here so these are my two bags and then the shoes that I'm bringing are just my leopard print crocs for around the house and um my uggs my cream yeezys and I'm thinking about my McQueen's but saturday we're probably gonna be doing walking and stuff like not too much walking but like walking from like place to place because we're going to dc and i really do not want to be in the mcqueens so i don't know y'all like I'm, I'm gonna figure it out i'm gonna figure it out all right besties so we are on our way i just wanted to come on here and close out the vlog i love you guys so much don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see y'all in the next video bye